We're tracking another story in Hendry County tonight, also in Clewiston. A principal who's seen paddling a student in a video has been cleared of any potential criminal charges by the state attorney's office. A review by that office outlines evidence that the mother of this child not only consented to the discipline, but asked for it to happen. According to the principal, the mother was called after this child damaged school property. And the report goes on to say the mother told staff that her daughter was also damaging things at their home. And the mother said she was afraid to spank the child because the child was threatening to call police. Well, the report states the mother actually requested school staff spank that child for her. They say she had to bring her into the school for that to happen and that she actually requested the paddling and was present for it. Well, Florida is one of 19 states. Digging a little more to give you more information on which corporal punishment is allowed in school. Private schools, for the most part, have banned the practice, but there are some public schools that still allow for the policy. In fact, Florida law on school corporal punishment does not require schools to even get your consent as a parent or grandparent before they actually paddle your student, although a lot of school districts do send home a waiver asking parents to give that written permission.